Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Aesulf and welcome back to my brand new video. I know, it's been a while again, but you know, I'm back here again, brought you guys a really amazing creation that I created today. And as you guys saw by the title, it's about a dog sledding. So yeah, this creation is really cool and really fun to play with. So if you guys want to have this in your world, you should follow me carefully along with the video. Bye. First of all, guys, listen up. If you guys end up enjoying this video, please make sure to leave a like in this video. And also, subscribe to my channel if you guys haven't already. But if you guys end up like hating or dislike this video, you can just easily dislike this video. So yeah, uh, without further ado, let's start the tutorial. So first of all, what you guys want to do is to prepare the material. And, and the material that you need are command block, first of all. And second of all, it's redstone comparator, anvil, and three name tags with different names on it. And a wolf and lead, bone, leather boots, fishing rod, and wooden axe. So if you guys have all of those material, then after that, what you guys want to do is to place the command block. So, oh, actually, no. Actually, what you guys want to do first is to tame the wolf. So you guys have to place three wolf, then tame all of them. So there you go. Why is it so long? There you go. Then after that, when you guys tamed all of this wolf, then you guys want to name them by name tag. So like, for example, I have the first name tag I named Wolfie, the second one Coco and Diego. But this can be random for you guys, you can name them anything you want. So yeah, so for the first one, Wolfie, I'm gonna name you Wolfie, your Coco and your Diego. And you guys need to name them differently, remember, because it's really important. Alright, so after you name all of them, then you gotta let them sit. Then after that, what you guys wanna do is to type in the chat box, um, slash summon my card then after that what you guys want to do is to type slash tag at e bracket type equals mine cart bracket then add cart so you guys want to type this then after that hit enter so that should be the first step then after that what you guys want to do is to prepare the command block and uh, when you get your command block, then after that, place your command block. And then for this one, the first one, what you guys want inside is execute at e uh, bracket type um, mine cart uh, comma tag equals cart. Then close bracket. Then after that, three tildes. Then after that, tp at e bracket um type vex comma name point then after that this symbols and then five then another th two of these symbols then after that you guys have to change the command block type to repeat and always active then after that go back to the chat box and type summon vex then point you're gonna name the vex point because we have put point in this command block so after that what should happen is that this vex will be will be teleported in front of this card because that's what this command block does when you got that right then after that what you guys want to do is to stand on top of this command block you guys have to sneak jump and place another command block and make sure the arrow of the command block facing upward it's really important then after that for this one what you guys want to type is effect at e bracket type um equal vex comma uh then name point uh close bracket invisibility one space one space true then after that you guys have to change the block type to chain conditional and always active so as you guys can see the vex is invisible now but you can still see the sword and if you guys want to to get rid of it what you guys want to do is to type slash replace item entity at e name point or type vex it's up to you 
slot dot weapon dot um, main hand one air so when you click enter the vex would not holding the sword anymore as you guys can see then if you guys got that right what you guys want to do next is to place another command block right over here you can actually can place it anywhere you want it doesn't have to be close to this command block uh for this command block what you guys want to type is execute at p three tildes test four at e bracket type equals minecart comma tag equals cart then comma r for radius one then close bracket then after that you have to change this block type to repeat and always active then after that place another command block on top of this this one but make sure again the arrow facing upward as always okay and for this one what you guys want to type is execute at p three tildes execute at e bracket type minecart um comma tag equal cart comma r uh equal one close bracket then after that another three tildes then cp at e type wolf comma name so for this one you guys want to choose which one of your dog that you want to pick as the captain like for example so i have diego i have coco let me choose wolfie as the captain okay so you guys want to type the name of your dog captain okay so you want to type wolfie then close bracket then after that you guys want to type the symbol then four then space symbol symbol and then facing at e bracket type vex comma name equal point and close bracket then after that what you guys want to do is to change the block type to chain conditional and always active then after that you guys want to stand on top of this one this command block and make sure again all the error facing upward then for this one what you guys want to do is to type execute at e uh bracket type equals wolf name wolfie again the captain close bracket then three tildes tp at e bracket type equals wolf comma name equals then after that for this name you guys want to choose between these two dogs like for example let's let's choose coco for this one then close bracket then this symbols then minus one do this again and minus one and then facing at e bracket type equals vex name comma name equals coin then close bracket now after that change the, this block type to chain conditional and always active and for the next one again put another command block on top of this command block all the error facing upward and then what you guys want to do is to type execute at e bracket type equals wolf comma name equals the captain wolfie three tildes tp at e type wolf comma name diego then this symbol again then one then another of this symbol then minus one then facing at e bracket type vex name point equals point and then change this block type to chain conditional and always active then it should be it so if you hop on on this minecart hold on hold on there is something wrong here wait oh make sure to write everything correctly okay i made a mistake here you need to type vex normally and also here I saw facing not faxing all right so I fixed that so now if I hop on into this minecart everybody should stay in front of the minecart so yeah so you can ride this minecart and have them in position but the problem is you can't control this minecart so to do that you guys want to place a redstone comparator um facing away out of this command blocks and over here too and here too so three 
but I had stone comparator facing away out of this command block. And after that, place two command blocks and another two here and here too. So it will look something like this. Then after that, for this one, for the left side of this command block, you guys want to type enchant at p feather underscore falling. So enchant at p feather underscore falling. Then change the block type to repeat and keep the redstone at, as what it is. Then after that, for this one, you guys want to type execute at e bracket uh, type equals minecart comma tag equals cart. Then close bracket, then three tildes. Then after that, tp this symbols. Then after that, 0 0.4. Then another of this symbols. Then one tilde. Then minus four. And then change the block type to chain conditional and always active. Then for this one, for the first one on the bottom command block, you guys want to type enchant at p smite. Change the block type to repeat and keep everything as what it is. Then for this one, you guys want to type execute the same th the same thing as, as this one, only now change the minus four to four. So execute um, at e type minecart comma tag cart close bracket three tildes tp the symbols 0 0.4 then another of two of these symbols then tilde then four change the block type to chain conditional and always active and for this one enchant at p lure so enchant at p lure so repeat and keep is what it is for this one execute same one again without the tilde chain conditional and always active and that's it so to use it first you gotta rope your dogs then hop on into the minecart then they will stand in position now to control what you gotta do is to use the axe to turn right use the fishing rod to go straight and the leather boots to turn left but first i think i need to tune it up a bit it's kind of glitchy maybe let's use two guys just change all the radius to two okay so it would not be as glitchy all right it should work now let's try it out and there you go a dog sledding in minecraft bedrock edition just using command block without any mods is really cool and you can play around with your friends you know and just show them who's the boss but just for a reminder there are still a few glitches with this creation so when you want to use this sledding dog or dog sledding you gotta use it in a flat world or in a flat ground because you can use this dog sledding to go through wall and just easily suffocated the dog so yeah you gotta watch out and also also, also you can kind of fly with it so yeah hello how are you i am under the water please help me